we knew, given what the science was telling us, that we could complement regular rehabilitation with a new neurorestorative approach using a novel form of neuroanimation. So we needed to create something that was immersive, emotional, enjoyable, and made you do three things. You had to do motor skill, you had to do cardiovascular exercise, and you had to be cognitively challenged. Results from our pilot trial suggest that this is twice as effective as regular therapy when given the subacute stroke period. We knew all along that we wanted some kind of mapping between a human intelligence and an animal intelligence where you forgot about your own deficit and you actually enjoyed being skilled again. Dolphins move continuously in the water. They're considered highly intelligent. They're highly playful. They express their intelligence through their movements. So it was perfect. The dolphins had to be studied in everything they did in terms of their interactions with each other, their interactions with humans, the way they swam, the kind of strategies you saw them develop under the water, because in the end you had to develop a soft body dynamic physics engine that simulated perfectly the movements of dolphins. You need to have people walk in and leave the normal world behind and feel they've stepped into a special space where both in terms of sound, sight and vision they are inspired has to be continuously entertaining. It has to be titrated in terms of difficulty. In other words, it has to get more and more challenging the better you get. You want to step in and leave the world behind and feel good again about your body. That's extremely important. Feel that there's hope that with practice as Bandit the Dolphin, you're actually going to improve your nervous system. And so what you really want is to have rooms like this in hospitals, in outpatient clinics, in your local high street, so whether you're healthy aging or you're frail or you have early neurodegenerative disease or you're a chronic stroke patient, you can just walk into one of these beautiful spaces no matter where you are in the world. That's really what I want.